Wow! That's the way I like to tell a story. I like to paint a picture. Story should be short and simple. Don't tell me anything I don't need to know. I am taking you on a journey. I am not teaching you how to build a bookcase. Seriously? You saw me waiting. You couldn't tell me you weren't leaving? You brought your own shopping bags, but you left your manners at home. I'm just saying, your story would be easier to follow if you didn't take so many side trips. And you thought about the build a little bit. You're with me on this, aren't you, Manny? I like Mom's stories. See? I'm just gonna pull in here. Twelve bucks? No wonder the middle class is so angry. There's no way you would be able to follow her story. Yes, you would have. Fine. Tell him again. A couple of weeks ago, I go to the grocery store. The one in Washington that has that tiny little wine bar to the right. So I come in, I'm looking for paper towels, and I think, mm, I'm going to treat myself with some wine and some cheese, because why not? So I order my drink, and when I look up, I thought I saw Sandra Bullock. Stop. Right there, you just said you thought you saw Sandra Bullock. I already know the ending. It wasn't her. End of story. Yeah, but you don't even know who it really was. But I know it's not Sandra Bullock, so I'm not invested. You know, I really loved her in that movie, Gravity. Who cares? She wasn't there. Oh, please be leaving. May I finish my story? So, I start following Sandra Bullock. Not Sandra Bullock. Around the grocery store. She goes first to the frozen section. Then she goes to the detergent aisle. I'm thinking to myself this whole time, I am gonna go and introduce myself, but it has to be at the right time. So I keep following her. Eventually, she leaves the store. She goes outside, which was actually really hot to be January, because remember last year- We know the month, we know the weather, we know it's not Sandra Bullock. Are you leaving? I want your spot. Oh, please. Don't flatter yourself, lady. Manny, are you listening? No, sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Because you're not holding his attention. And this is what I've been talking about. Too many useless details. Get on with it. So she turns around, she takes her sunglasses off, which was really weird because it was the exact same pair that I bought last year that I lost on that plane ride. Nobody right cares we about your sunglasses. Just get to the end. I don't want to now. The woman turns to your mother and says, oh my God, are you Salma Hayek? Here we go. I'm just trying to help you. Put on blinker, check me.